State and county officials are looking to boost rural communities. Lieutenant Governor Suzanne Crouch hosted a roundtable with Park and Montgomery County officials. They discussed what the state can do to give rural communities the tools they need to grow. Terry Craig was at this forum and joins us now with the details. Turkey Run State Park Plate hosts the Thriving Rural Communities Roundtable. It's where state and county leaders gather to brainstorm ideas on how to advance rural areas. Rural Indiana is our next great economic frontier. Several rural communities across Indiana are poised for growth. State officials say Park County is one of them. Lieutenant Governor Suzanne Kraut says the state wants to partner with rural areas to see what they need to thrive. While they have challenges just like the more urban areas, they're somewhat distinct and unique. So it was good to hear about those, to be able to figure out and to learn how we can partner with them better. Park County Councilman John Pratt says this forum between county government and the state was positive. It's important to let her know what is going on here in Park County for us to try to better our community and make this a greater place to live than it already is. Improving quality of life, regionalism, and housing were all big topics at the forum, but one specific issue that Park County is facing is its roads. And certainly the infrastructure is, is always going to be a challenge for us. Our roads, we have 50% gravel and 50% blacktop. Another aspect of growing rural counties is regionalism. Officials say that working with neighboring counties will benefit all involved. With a population of near 17,000 here in Park County, we are uh, the density is just not here for us to do some of the some of the things that we need to do. And by partnering possibly with uh, Vigo County or possibly uh, Montgomery County, why well, would really help stretch those dollars? This is the fourth thriving rural communities roundtable that the lieutenant governor has hosted.